Listen up, everybody. We're going to hear from a dude who is truly cool and very fresh. But he's got a problem that he wants to lay on us. Uh, come on in, Ernie, my man. <sighs> Excuse me, Mr. Hoots, I hate to bug a busy bird, but I want to learn the sax, and I need a helpful word. I always get a silly squeak when I play the blues. Ernie, keep you cool, I'll teach you how to blow the sax. I think I did your problem, it's rubber and it quacks. You'll never find the skill you seek till you pay your dues. You gotta put down the ducky. Put down the ducky. Ducky? By all means! Oh, 
Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, Ducky, I missed you so much. Yes, me too. Take care, Ernie, my man. That is one cool cat. No, 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 Hey, Squirt, you still here? No, Mr. Conductor, please disappear. Who's that you're talking to? Nobody. Nobody, huh? What's that you got behind your back? It's that tiny guy my dumb uncle's always looking for. Get out of my way. No! I said, get out of my way or I'll beat you up. No! I said I'd beat you up! You get away from here! Leave Mr. Conductor alone! You oh. lay one hand on Mr. Conductor, and now I'll, I'll turn you upside down. Upside down? I'll, I'll spin you around by your feet. My feet? Yeah. I'll stick that ice cream cone on your head. Now take it easy, calm down, will ya? Give me my nickel back. Here, here. Uh, take your nickel. Just don't hurt me, please. Ah, uh, Buster. <laughs> Here's another ice cream cone for you. Stay away from that kid. He's dangerous. Oh, wow. Wait till J.B. King finds out that you scared off his nephew. His very special favorite nephew. Yeah, we'll see how tough you are after I tell my dumb uncle what happened. Then I can draw on the walls all I want. Oh, hello, Uncle JB. I was just telling them about how well you run the railroad. You're already in enough trouble, Buster. Don't make it worse by lying to me. Oh, but whatever do you mean, Uncle JB? We were just having fun. Buster, we'll talk about it later. Wait for me outside. I never get to have any fun. It's all his fault. Outside. Dan, on behalf of the entire King family, I apologize to you. Uh, I'd just like to point out that it was uh, all my idea that he did what he did. Here's a little ice cream cone for you. And if uh, you have any other problems that you need to be solved, just uh, give me a call. Oh, exalted one. You were protecting someone smaller than yourself, weren't you? Well, that was a mighty fine thing to do. I'm proud of you, Dan. May I shake your hand? I think you should have this. And I think I should go have a little talk with my nephew. Did you get to see Mr. Conductor? No. But I somehow think he had his little hand in all of this, didn't he? So now I know that he's around here. Somewhere. Shining Time Station is brought to you today by the letter X and by the number zero. Shining Time Station and Sesame Street is a production of the Children's Television Workshop. Reach for the speed, reach for the whistle, go where the rail may run. Reach for the words, reach for the story, follow the rainbow sun. To a Shining Time Station, where dreams can come true, waiting there for you. So much to see, so far to travel, so much to learn to know. Friends by your side, hopes to hold on to, who knows how far you'll go. To a shining time station, where dreams can come true.